Hi, welcome back to Impossible 2.0. Next up, I have Libras. Where are my possible Libras at? The time now is 728. 17 is, is 8. Okay. Yes. So, infinite sign. You guys are um, manifesting. 8 means a lot of things. It means abundance. It means that you guys are still under spiritual development. But you're really in your spiritual realm at this time. But manifesting unfinished business. Okay. Finishing up projects as well but i feel really good about your reading you may be stuck in traffic but somebody definitely wants your attention a lot of people want your attention okay so let's get started guys let's get started libras <laughs> okay let me start with my kitty cats okay <laughs> i'm not feeling it that's what i heard i'm not feeling it you're not feeling people at this time okay but I guess you fucked it with the wrong one. Yes. <laughs> yeah, bliss. Contentment is at hand. You're feeling good about oneself, okay? You're not feeling it, okay? You're not paying people any attention, but people want your attention, okay? Yes, you're going with the flow of things as well. But you can feel your blessings coming in. Eight, you're manifesting. You see the eyes closed? You're manifesting, and you can feel it coming in. Uh-huh. But you have somebody on a leash right now, on the leash. <laughs> Some of you guys may like to wear neck chokers as well. <laughs> okay, but finding your happiness, okay? Being happy and content in oneself. Yes. Uh-huh. Grace. Yes, we are all connected. All right? Yes. But there's somebody, your blessings are definitely coming in. All right? Mm-hmm. But there's somebody that's going to ask your hand in marriage. There's somebody that's going to ask your hand in marriage. I do see somebody needs your help as well. But grace. Doing things, it's like gracefully. Okay? Yes. Showing love. Spreading love. Yeah. Improvisation. Some of you guys may be dancers, ballet dancers, actors, actresses, Broadway shows, singers. The unicorn though. Magical, mystical, unique. Okay, yes. Dancing around, motherfuckers. <laughs> two, you're two-stepping on motherfuckers right now. <laughs> okay. Hey, it is what it is. <laughs> okay, have you seen this dance step? Now you see me spinning on motherfuckers, have a motherfuckers head spinning. Okay, like, ta-da! Did you like that magic trick? <laughs> All right, yeah. But some of you guys are, are ballet dancers, okay? But improvisation, just make it up. So, okay, it's like uh, you have the power to uh, improvise, okay? So if one thing doesn't work, it's like, you know, you find another way. You'll find another way, okay? But you have some type of performer around you as well, okay? Yes. Some of you guys may be going to some type of audition as well, yes. But yes, performers, you have a, a, a performer around you. Some of you guys, your children may be performers, okay? Yeah, uh, you may be getting a text of some sort. Some of you guys may name may be Denise or Daniel as well. Yeah, but you're improvising, okay? You're, you're telling people, let me show you how you do this. Okay, I like that, but did you see this? Okay, people don't know how you do it. <laughs> All right? You're just nice with it. You're just nice with it. Okay? Yes. Yeah, you're going you're gonna to be getting an unexpected uh, text message. Okay? Yep. Yeah. There you go. Your blessings are definitely coming in. Fulfillment for you. Some of you guys may live in Georgia, okay? Have your own um, fruit garden or plant, um, you know, plant your own, you know, have your own garden, okay? Flowers and stuff like that. Some of you guys may have a peach bottom. I'm just saying, <laughs> nice and cushiony. <laughs> okay, yes, but your blessings are definitely pouring in, guys. Eight, abundance, okay? Health, wealth, but... With the canary here, you know, people are going to be jealous, talking about you. They're talking about you now, okay? And you're delving into new ideas, okay? Things are budding around you. And as you can see, you still have creativity that you have, you know, unfinished projects that needs that still needs to be tended to, okay? Yes. So you're implementing your ideas, blooming. Some are still blooming and some are still budded, okay? Yes. But you're watering your ideas. 
okay but with the with the canary here you know people are talking gossiping but your fulfillment yeah things are growing okay things are about to pick up for you some of you guys may love any, anything peach yeah and you're embracing this change and going with the flow okay and happiness is on the horizon and i do see a soulmate coming in some type of collaboration as well but you're going to be in sync with each other this may be a leo you may love dolphins and work or work with animals or sea world or something like that okay or going on vacation there but definitely happiness is on the horizon and you guys are going to be in sync with each other okay yes going with the flow and i do see somebody asking your hand in marriage okay or you're proposing to someone all right yes all right, but I do see a bright future ahead for you guys. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yes, don't let pride get in your way. That came in reverse, right? Because you guys are not very prideful, but you guys are grateful, okay? Yes, and embracing this change, okay? Going with the flow. And you playing motherfuckers at their own game. Like, you're being kind about things. You are you you understand that people don't like you or whatever the case may be. So you're distancing yourself. But at the same time, you're not showing people. Like, you're not giving it to people. You understand. You understand. Like, okay, I know you don't like me, but you're smiling in, your fa in their face. Like, <laughs> I see you. <laughs> but I'm going to play this game with you. Okay, yeah, luck is on your side. There you go. Some of you guys may be dealing with a Sagittarius. Or have moon in your Sagittarius, okay? But again, you're not missing the target. Boop. You're not missing the target. You're on. You're on key. You know what time it is. But you're looking at things. You're you're all about expansion, and you're looking at the bigger picture, okay? Of what could be, all right? But you got a motherfucker's ass. <laughs> when they want it, they can get it. Let me stop. <laughs> okay, you're not gonna miss your target. You're not gonna miss your target. I tell you that much, okay? You're you're very much aware. Okay. <laughs> Woo they better stop playing. Okay. But luck is definitely on your side, guys. I'm so excited for you. Okay. Be careful with accidents. Because, oh, another thing. If you guys don't like me talking about accidents because people are like, oh, I wish you would stop talking about accidents. This is the real world. Okay. This is life. Okay, life is scary. Oh, you scaring me and stuff like that. Well, life is scary. Accidents do happen and I do have to forewarn people about accidents and stuff like that and to be aware of their surroundings and people. This is what my channel is about. So if you don't like it, then go to another channel. But I'm going to warn my people to be careful. Okay, that's what it's all about. Yes, you have a deep knowing. You're highly intuitive. Okay, and you're following your intuitions with people. Okay, yes. Pay attention to your downloads. Your ancestors are looking over you, but peace is being restored in your life, okay? You're highly intuitive. Pay attention to your, to your dreams and signs and synchronicities at this time, Libras, okay? Yes, to the sea. Again, some of you guys are going on a cruise. Some of you guys may work in the water as well, you know, be fish, um, love to fish, about, but to the sea, you're sailing away, and I do see somebody coming in towards you. You may be dating someone overseas, okay? You may be moving overseas, but whatever it is, you're moving forward, okay? But in silence, and you're following your intuitions, yes. Seven is all about blessings, but seven also speaks of religious factors and Jesus and going back to church and staying prayed up at this time, okay? Yeah, but you're moving forward, but you see, you're keeping an eye on things. You see, with the binoculars here, you're keeping an eye on things. Okay, they keeping an eye on you, but you're keeping an eye on things as well. But in silence, okay? Yes. To the sea, off you go. Okay? Yes. And you guys are on a spiritual journey. Yes. Following your life purpose, on the right path. Okay? All right. So, let's begin your reading, guys. Okay, this is my very first deck. Some of you guys may be dealing with a Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Okay, but this is all about, you're all about stability, security. Some of you guys may be married out there as well, but I do see you all about business. Okay, making business moves. All right, yeah, silently, silent, silent moves. Okay, follow your intuition. Some of you guys may be tarot readers, getting tarot readings as well, balancing out practicality and spirituality. Okay, yes. But highly intuitive, highly intuitive. But I do see a spiritual connection coming in towards you guys. Some of you guys may be pre preachers, pastors, bishops, deacons, opening up your own organization, shamans out there, teach the spiritual word as well. Very enlightened and very wise people spreading, spreading their light to the world. 
Okay? Yes. Whatever that may be. But I do see you traveling the world as well. Traveling the world or being known worldwide. Like you're you're gonna be known across the seas. Okay? Yes. Across. People are gonna know you. But you're being divinely guided at this time. Yeah, two of swords. You're blocking people out. <laughs> From what they can see. You're just blocking people. Okay? Period. All right? But you feel like there's an indecision. There's a decision that you have to make. Um, and you're at a stalemate at this time. Okay? But you're just blocked off. Okay? But spirit is blocking any type of energies or any energy vampires coming in towards you guys as well. Yeah, five of cups. Okay, some of you guys may be doing emotionally drinking, drinking out there. Some of you guys may be trying to get rid of addictions. Some of you guys are getting rid of a codependent, uh, codependent habits or relationship. Okay, yes. Some of you guys are grieving the loss of a loved one as well. Be careful with water. Okay, swimming, water, your children, water. All right, but there's still two cups standing. There's still two cups standing that you cannot see. But there's somebody grieving and have regrets about you as well. Some of you guys may be widows out there. Some of you guys are not ready for a connection. Some of you guys are still healing, okay, going through the healing process, okay. But with the two of cups, I do see a partnership coming in and a soulmate or a twin flame, okay, justice. Some of you guys may be going to court, Libra. Yeah, some of you guys may be feel burdened at this time with finances. There's a lot of shit going on. But I do see you're going to get your justice. Luck is on your side. So try to balance out. Uh, you're trying to balance out things in your life, okay? Yes. But somebody is in regret about you, okay? Yeah, eight of swords. Some of you guys, your loved ones may be getting released from jail. You may be getting released from jail as well, okay? Yes, but you're, uh, you're coming out of, a, again, breaking free from toxic situations and toxic habits, okay? Yes, breaking free. Spirit is breaking those ties, karmic ties, soul ties. Yes, you see, page of swords. There's somebody spying on you. So, so somebody spying on you and your success, okay? Because I do see you in the World Wide Web, and like I said, people know you overseas around the world, or you may be traveling the world. But whatever it is, I do see you getting some type of honors, recognition, okay? I do see a proposal, but there's a lot of people that want your attention. And I do see somebody, you meeting somebody on the internet, okay? Somebody very successful coming in towards you guys. I do see you guys single and abundant, but somebody single coming in, and I do see this being a partnership of some kind. Okay, with the world and the two of cups here. This person possibly have uh, their own social media base that you're going to be collaborating with. I do see it's going to be an even give and take. Okay, but somebody's coming in with a generous offer. Okay, some of you guys may do charity work as well. Um, be, be pro bono, like, you know, you know, work pro bono. But whatever it is, I do see your money picking up. I do see you being the boss of your own company. Okay, whoa. Okay, yes, yes, yes. Uh-huh. You guys are an emperor, empress status, okay? Worldwide success. Some of you guys are, again, single, but I do see an emperor, empress coming in. But you're emperor, empress status with a lot of fucking money in your own business. You're all about work and working on yourself. But I do see you working on new projects as well. Your blessings are definitely coming in, guys, okay? Yes, God is on your side. You guys are religious. Again, people looking up to you, all right? You teaching people, sharing your light, spreading your light. Yes. Okay, some of you guys may be getting married all of a sudden. It's just, you're just going to get married. Um, you know, some of you guys may be getting married overseas or planning some type of big event. But whoever is coming in towards you, this is big money. This is a big business deal that's going to take you by surprise. Something that you pay for, um, prayed for, but pay, <laughs> somebody's going to pay you for your work. Okay, definitely. But you're working on your legacy at this time. Yes. And I do see with the Wheel of Fortune, your good fortune is definitely coming in. Okay, yes. You may be dealing with a, a Taurus, Aquarius, Scorpio, Leo, Aries. Okay, yes. But there's somebody that has their eye on you. Right now, you're in the cut, staying prayed up. All right, in spiritual solitude. But let me see who has their eye on you here because this is bothering me and I don't like eyes. Okay. Uh, I, I don't like people spying. Yeah, somebody's thinking about sending you a message. But I do see some form of good news coming in towards you guys. Yeah, something in somebody's secretly spying on you here and secretly spying on your social media and what people write to you so if you have like a instagram facebook tiktok youtube somebody's searching what other people write to you secretly spying on your social media base okay 
trying to figure out your moves and your money moves at this time. But you're moving in silence. Okay? Yes. Great partnerships coming. Yes, the Empress Emperor. This is your perfect match. This is your perfect match. Okay, this is definitely a boss. Okay, somebody that's bossed up. All right, that has creativity, creative ideas that they want to like, you know, they want to get in some, some type of business. Some of you guys are already married. Okay, out there and your significant other is spying on you. <laughs> some of you guys are, yeah, already um, have a business with your partner. Okay. Yeah, some of you guys uh, are pregnant okay or have someone pregnant but yeah this is possibly a third party situation for some of you guys i'm not gonna lie but whatever it is um you are possibly friends or hang out together or you're gonna meet this person through some type of invitation or through some type of friends or work endeavor okay yeah it's gonna start off as friends okay getting to know each other because this person have high regards for oneself high standards so i don't see this as friends with benefits i see this as you get to know each other, hanging out with each other, meeting through some type of company, some type of invitation, some type of work venture, okay? And getting to know each other and it's gonna be picking up to more because this person wants to work with you. There you go, bam. This person wants to work with you. This person possibly gets a lot of attention or you do, okay? But there's a lot of competition surrounding you at this time, okay? Mm-hmm, a lot of competition, yes. Jealousy. But there is definitely a boss that um, favors you, okay? Some of you guys may be dating the boss, but there's somebody, a boss, that favors you. And I do see some type of promotion, and they're looking at your work, okay? How you work, how you work with others. And I do see you overseeing people at work as well. You're going to be overseeing a group of people, and they're going to be jealous and mad, okay? Now, with the Ten of Cups, this could be, again, your husband, your wife, or somebody that you, but this is true love. Because whatever it is, you guys are going to meet through work, and I do see you building a firm foundation with this person. Ten of Pentacles and Ten of, ten of Cups, okay, with this person. But there's a lot of people that is fighting for a position that you're going to get, okay? So if you already promoted, I do see you getting another promotion. A lot of people jealous of you. You may have favor with the boss at work as well. Yeah, king, queen of wands. There may be somebody involved. Um, okay. This may be a same-sex relationship, but there may be somebody else involved in the situation. So somebody here may be married and fooling around at work, or, you know, there's suspicion of somebody fooling around at work. But there's somebody looking very good here, okay? You guys are looking very good here, all right? And, um, again, this may be somebody that has a family already and, you know, is a boss that's fooling around with somebody else, okay? I'm just saying. But for whatever reason it is, you know, you're very brave and you're very courageous and you're taking the lead in your life and you're very independent and passionate about what you do, okay? Yeah, there's somebody walking away from a situation here, okay? Mm-hmm. This is the end of a tough cycle, uh, betrayal, backstab here. Why? Yeah, the magician. You're manifesting, but somebody's manifesting you as well. Okay? Somebody that you possibly walked away from is manifesting you back into their life. Okay? But there, be careful with mind games at work. Because this is somebody younger. This could be somebody younger as well. With a page of pentacles and a magician, this could be somebody younger as well. Okay? Mm -hmm. But I do see whatever it is, uh, if you guys are going to court, it's some type of payment coming in. Mm -hmm. Yes. This may be a soulmate, a past life love that's coming in. Or somebody that you know from the past that you guys are possibly going to get married to. Mm -hmm. You're going to have a choice here. Because somebody has feelings here. Yeah, because I do see somebody single. But they're not yet. Yeah, you look, the page of swords. Spy. This person may work for the law or be some type of judge or, or some type of person of high status that's watching. Yes, they have feelings. They have feelings. This pos person possibly ran away from the way they felt about you. Okay? 
Yes, this person possibly wanted to have their cake and eat it too. Uh-huh. But for whatever it is, I don't see sex, but I do see somebody having feelings here for somebody else. I don't see sex yet. Yeah, there may be some type of pregnancy involved here, but things being illuminated, and I do see you being very successful. Okay? Yes. Yeah, this may have been a third-party situation where there's conflict and fights and arguments and competition here for somebody's attention. But I do see whatever it is, somebody's picking you. They're choosing you. Okay? Yes. Because I do see you being the emperor, empress. This person's perfect match. Mm -hmm. There may have been somebody else involved, but somebody's walking away from somebody here and choosing you. This could be in your own marriage. Yeah, this is long term. Somebody wants long term with you. They're coming to, and you've been you've been waiting for a long time for this. But right now, you're just focused on your business prospects. Okay, you're focused on long term success. But somebody wants to settle down with you here. They want to offer you a pentacle to settle down. Yes, yeah, they want your attention. They're not giving up on this connection. Okay, but you're not giving up on success. But I do see long term success coming in towards you guys. Okay, yes, lots and lots of fucking money. Lots of money. All right. Yes, there may there may have been somebody else here trying to seduce somebody as well. If this is your marriage, because I do see you guys being some type of business owners or celebrities out there. Okay, but there may be somebody here that was trying to seduce someone here as well. Okay, and you caught on to the act. Yeah, because you guys are married. You guys have a business together. You guys are, are fruitful. But there was a time moment that happened here, some type of truth exposed here in a situation. Okay? But there's a breakthrough coming and new beginnings. Yeah, okay, yeah. There was sex here. Somebody possibly has sex with somebody else. The truth came out. Okay, about this person or pregnancy or a child. But, yeah, but I do see whatever it is, some of you guys are not giving up on this connection because you guys have a business together or you guys trying to work it out because, again, it's a lot of finances here involved. But, yeah, for whatever it is, um, I do see you guys, it's, it's, it's in it for the long haul with this person because you guys work together, okay? Yes, but there was somebody else here trying to, sabotage this connection this person possibly already had kids when you got with this person and then somebody came up in the mix and tried to like flirt or trying to like you know money and court and you know you you owe me child support and stuff like that yes but this was like it took a toll on you it took a toll on you because definitely you guys are married out there and uh have a successful business with this person um but there's a lot of eyes on your success but there's somebody here that's trying to stall payment as well. Because I do see there's somebody here that was possibly gossiping and spreading nasty things about you. Five of Wands to the to the Queen of Wands. Possibly talking about your family here or your kids of some sort. Yeah, because when I see this and you took this person, it's like some type of court here that you took this person to court or you're taking this person to court and they need to pay you some money. But there was somebody here that was trying to stall um you stole but i do see a victory when it came to you winning a case and somebody has to pay you a lot of fucking money here okay and it, a lot of fucking money it was rapid justice for you rapid justice for you yes you were very successful and i do see this person was trying to stall to pay you money okay but i do see this person is going to have to pay you money it, it could be through uh, projects of some sort. Again, talking about your family, spreading like defamation of character of some sort because I do see that as well. Somebody was talking shit. Yeah, but they're spying, okay? They're spying. <laughs> yeah, somebody has to pay you a lot of money here, okay? And they're gonna pay in increments, in increments, okay? Yes. Uh-huh, they're in their feelings about this shit and they're keeping an eye on you, all right? Yes. But whatever it is, you're suing someone over your property, over money, okay, uh, what they saying, this person was talking shit, and you're going to get your fucking money, okay? Yeah, new beginnings for you, the food car, new beginnings for you, your project's taking off, okay? You traveling, <laughs> expanding, uh, Aries, Aquarius, okay, taking a leap of faith, yes, all about work and business.
and it's growing. It's growing, but I do, I do see a lot of sex too. Yeah, but right now you're blocking people from what they can see. Okay, you're very defensive and you're taking a stand. Okay, mm -hmm. this person was possibly trying to defend themselves, but I do see with the Ace of Wands here again. With the Ace of Wands, this could be some type of gossip being spread too. Somebody spreading the word about shit. Okay, and um, you had to defend yourself against this whatever was said. Yeah, you had to defend yourself because this person was very jealous and envious over you. Okay. Possibly talking about your spouse as well. Okay, yeah. The lovers talking about you, the lovers, and yeah. But the lovers, you're going to have a choice here in love or a choice here in terms of partnerships, business partnerships. Okay, but I do see a new love coming in and somebody having a crush on you here. But again, you're ghosting people. You're not you're not really focused on love, but you're putting all your love into your work, which you are doing so silently. Okay? Yes. And your love life, you're keeping hush. Okay? But right now, you're in spiritual solitude. And with the star cards, some of you guys are still healing. Okay? Yes. It's like ghosting energy and blocked off energy here. Uh-huh. One more. Yeah. But sun, happiness. Happiness, success, yes, riding into success. That's what you're doing. You're riding into success, okay? Yes, but there's a lot of people obsessed with you as well. But there's somebody, be careful with somebody popping up on you as well, out of nowhere. Yes, be careful with this. But this, this is beautiful. This is a beautiful reading. So far, so good, but yeah. But you're, you're trying to move away from bad habits and toxic environments at this time and toxic people. Okay, Capricorn, Cancer, Leo. Okay? Yes. Mm -hmm. But you're moving in silence. Yes, a lot of clarity. A lot of clarity in your life, but very, very successful people out there. Very successful. Okay? Yes. Getting your awards. Getting your accolades. Mm -hmm. But you're getting, you're getting justice. And somebody has to pay you money. Lots of money. Lots and lots of fucking money. Okay. Let's see what's going on here. Yeah, prove it. You see? So there was somebody here, I got 99 problems. Yeah, there's somebody that got 99 problems. Listen, listen to this. You see how the mouth has tape on it? There was somebody talking shit, and now uh, what shit they talking? Give me my fucking money. Because there was somebody that, there's a lot of gossip, but now they got 99 problems because they got to pay you some motherfucking money. Because I do see you guys taking action. Okay, so whoever is bad-mouthing you or whatever at work or whatever the case may be or trying to spread some fucking shit, fuckery, you're doing shit the right way. I'm sorry. I'm taking off my, my slippers. Okay. Yes. But there's somebody here that was lying and they didn't want to fess up to their truth. Okay. So you're like, shut the fuck up. Okay. Catch the people and their fucking lies and shit. Yeah. There's some, there's a codependent energy going on here. There's somebody desperate. They, there's somebody that doesn't want to let you go. Okay. Fear of ending a relationship. Some of you guys may have been talking about separation as well. But there's somebody here that's just in your energy that don't want to let you go. Yeah, a smooth talker. Okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talking their way out of trouble. But the rival. See, there's somebody here that's a rival. Okay? Yes. Online dating. I do see online dating for you guys. But there's somebody here that is like a, a choose me kind of person. Like, okay, strong influence on your person. Okay, trying to seduce, trying to seduce and trying to get that. Okay, the trying to get the divine masculine feminine here. Okay. Yes. But you're you're in control of yourself. You're in control. Okay? Yes, because there's a faded love coming in. Uh-huh. Or you guys already have a faded love or with your soulmate already, but definitely there's a life partner coming in for you guys emperor empress if you haven't met this person already with a lot of money but i do see online okay but you're following your heart okay yes 
you choosing to be happy, but there's somebody coming in that's going to be madly in love, okay? But right now, you're gaining a lot of clarity in your life, like I said. And stalemate in reverse. You're breaking those chains. You're breaking those barriers with people. You're not allowing anybody to stagnate you and your growth. You're getting a new perspective, okay? Mm -hmm. But when this faded love come in, you're going to know. You're going to know. Yeah, single. Yeah, some of you guys are becoming single, are already single, okay? Or just you just enjoy the single life. You're not you're not choosing just settling for anyone at this time. But there's shocking event that's going to be unfolding in your life. So prepare for the unexpected, guys. Surprises and unlock it. Some of you guys may be getting a key to a new house, office. But again, locked doors are opening. Blockages are being removed at this time, guys. Love is coming in. Okay, so for those of you guys are who are waiting for love or single, there, there, you know, faded love coming in, okay? But you're going to have a choice in love. Yeah, it's going to be mutual feelings. There you go, okay? Yes, it's going to be mutual feelings. And I do see a compromise taking place here, even give and take. So you guys, yeah, bad intentions in reverse, okay? So somebody's coming in with pure intentions, but again, you're seeing people for who they are, Okay? Yes, you're following your intuition. As soon as you see the red flag, out, out they go. Yeah, I do see some type of pregnancy. Mm -hmm. Or somebody's trying to get pregnant here to trap somebody off, like I said. Okay, somebody that's very successful because some of you guys are very successful or are married and, you know, are in a successful union and somebody's trying to trap somebody off here or trying to trap you off. So careful, careful, careful with pregnancy, but giving birth to new ideas. Okay, I do see a divorce with some of you guys and alimony, something being paid out here. But whatever it is, yes, they're going to have to pay. You could, they're going to have to pay that money. Okay, yes, addiction. Again, somebody suffering from some type of addiction, codependent, sex addiction, alcohol, drugs, whatever. In the 3D, you're getting rid of this. Okay, you're getting rid of this. Yes, against time. Somebody feel like their time is running out when it comes to you. Okay, time is not on their hand. They're working on thin ice and they know it. Uh-huh. But first love. Yeah, your first love is coming in. Okay, yeah, you may have been dealing with a player, somebody that was toxic and fake, like to fool around with people. But you setting those healthy boundaries. Okay, secrets being revealed here. Yeah, opposites. Okay, but then you're going to be meeting somebody here. It's a love versus ego. Okay, but opposites attract. Yes, opposing forces, but you're cutting through the bullshit. Your sword is out. Okay. Yes, you're cutting through the bullshit. And I do see an engagement, like I said. Man, a proposal. All right, yeah. But you was going in circles with this, with people and places and things, and you're breaking those karmic ties and, and karmic situations. Yeah, see, somebody's regretful. About the way they treated you, about this player, toxic, and okay, but there's a first love coming in, a true love for you with mutual feelings, okay? Yes, yeah, you may have be hearing of a pregnancy that's gonna shock you as well, but mm -hmm. this is very interesting. This is very interesting, guys. Okay. Floodgates. Okay, but it came in reverse, but I'm putting it upright, okay, because it bounced off this deck, all right? But there's somebody that's going to be losing money here, like I said. Somebody has to pay you, but again, abundance, your abundance is coming in. Somebody's, somebody's losing money, and you're gaining. Well, that's all I'm going to have to say to that, because I see a lot of money coming in, okay, and somebody paying you in increments. <laughs> yeah, somebody was in their shadow side, okay? So, you guys, again, you're getting rid of this toxic people, toxic behavior, toxic environment, Okay, yes, getting rid of this. Lies, deceit, cheating, ego, dark side. 
dark energy that's around you, okay? Money hungry, greedy, selfish, prideful. Yeah, you may be dealing with a Taurus or have rising moon Venus or your North Node in Taurus, but it's all about perseverance, patience, being honest. There's somebody coming in that's reliable as well. Diligent, sensual, okay? Queen, king of earth. Some of you guys are married, like I said, but you're all about business, okay? And being a good provider as your stability and security. Yes, you're going to be very successful. Some of you guys are already successful. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you see, somebody had a side piece here. Somebody had a side piece, either you or another person, but there was somebody that's non-committal. Again, your perfect match is coming in. King, Queen of Earth, possibly a Taurus, or a, a, a Capricorn or a Virgo. But whatever it is, I do see you guys building your empire together. Yes, but there's somebody here in a marriage that had a fucking side piece, okay? I'm just saying, take it how it resonates. You know, you understand what's going on here, and I did see a pregnancy here, okay? Somebody's getting their money, and somebody's getting their karma. Capricorn Aquarius, you may be dealing with a Capricorn or Aquarius, but this is all about self-discipline and karma, concentration, okay? But there's somebody here that was a player, okay, that was just getting their rocks off and shit, possibly was married and being a player in their own marriage. Either you or the other person, I don't give a fuck. But you understand what I'm saying. But there's a leader coming in that has your eye on you that's very good looking, that's going to take action towards you okay but this is you take it again there's an entrepreneur coming in but again you guys are entrepreneurs okay yeah tower shit is gonna again kaboom surprises surprises i do see a divorce i do see trauma i do see destruction going on here somebody's trying to connect with you on the 5d okay this is a spiritual union <laughs> okay yes this may be a leo Okay, this person is very courageous, uh, strong, protective. Yeah, some of you guys need to do inner childhood wounding, healing, or this person was projecting on you their insecurities, okay? But again, this person is theatrical, okay? Yes, but there's somebody that's loyal coming in towards you guys that's fearless, affectionate, but you're fearless, okay? And I do see you guys being very successful or this person being very successful, okay? Yeah, somebody's definitely coming in with their communication, as well, but follow your intuitions. Oh, the throat, but somebody wants to communicate. Communication, but follow your intuitions. All right? Yes. Somebody is trying to find the right words to say as well. This person may be trying to balance out practicality or spirituality. This person may go to church with the cross. Okay, wear spiritual bracelets, be left handed, write music. Some of you guys are writers, uh, write music. Some of you guys work out. This person may work out, but for whatever it is, somebody's trying to find the right words to say. Okay? Yes. Okay, you may be dealing with an Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, but I do see you being very successful, traveling, okay, competitive, but prosperity, okay, closing out cycles, boom, yes, okay, yes. All right, let me get some love Jones here. <laughs> Wait, let me see what this person has to say to you. I'm going to get some love jokes as well. Because somebody definitely trying to communicate with you here. Okay. Yeah, I'm ready for you to meet my family. So definitely somebody wants to take it to the next level, okay? I will be, I know we will be together again, okay? So somebody has a knowing factor that you guys were going to be together again, okay? Yes. My feelings for you are as deep as the ocean. Yes, somebody is in love here, okay? I'm heavily feeling soulmate, twin flame, okay? Yeah, I'm ready to show you the real me. But again, you're going to have a choice to make because I do see two different people here that's coming in. Okay, I'm ready to show you the real me. So somebody was wearing a mask. Okay, they feel like their time is running out. Okay, I hope you haven't moved on. Okay, so again, this person, it's been a long time. So you guys have been waiting for a long time. Okay, but improvisation. I mean, you're not waiting. I want to start a family with you. Again, I do see some type of pregnancy or, you know, again, this person wants to start. Let's move in together. So somebody wants to move in together, guys. Okay. 
and I'm ready now. So somebody's definitely ready for you, ready to take action. I don't care who you're with, you are, you are mine. So this person is very demanding, okay, very protective, all right? They're coming, they're going to come in to demand. They're going to be demanding, okay? Like, okay, yeah, you had, you had, you had a Libra temporarily, I'm here now, okay? I don't know how you feel about that, but uh, 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 this person, yeah. Yeah, till death do us part. So some of you guys are married, or this person is married, okay? But somebody's coming in, they want long-term commitment with you. Like I said, I do see an engagement, okay? Yes, I did I this I did feel love spell, but we're not going there, okay? I can't move on. So somebody can't move on from your energy here. Libras. But I see you getting engaged with somebody new. Okay, health concerns. Somebody may be having health concerns here. Go check your health, guys. Okay. Yes, because I do see a new love. Again, new a new love, and you're going to be engaged. Some of you guys are tarot readers, or somebody getting tarot readers on you, but you're very insightful. Follow your intuition. Some of you guys need a tarot reading out there. Okay? Yes. Court and legal issues. Yes, I did see this, but I do see a huge win. Yes, some of you guys are in no contact with this person, no communication going on here, because this person wanted to have their cake and eat it too. Like I said, but I do see a pregnancy here. <laughs> yes. Yes, I need you. See, somebody is going to be like, I need you, I want you, but, you know, somebody hid their feelings here. They wasn't really open to feelings because they was just fucking around in player mode, okay? Yes. What is this? I'm scared to leave in reverse. So somebody's leaving a situation. I'm telling you, let's run away together. <laughs> okay? Yes, but you're going to say, let's just be friends. Okay? Sorry, I have somebody new. Okay, I'm afraid my family won't accept you. So again, religious, this di different backgrounds, religion, different belief system. Okay, yes. So they're afraid that their family won't accept you, but this person is obsessed with you. Okay, but you're moving on, and they want to move, but they're moving on too, and they want to come in towards you. They want to move in together. Okay, but this person wasn't ready to open up, but now they want to open up. Okay, and express to you how they feel. Okay, yes, they're manifesting your ass. Okay, if you just love me, if you love me, just say it. Because this person was afraid, but they want to know how you feel about them before they make any sudden moves. So depending on how you feel about them, Libra, if you express your feelings to them, and they didn't, you know, uh, reciprocate the feelings, I see that you just said, fuck it. Okay, but if you haven't expressed your feelings, this person is waiting for you to express your feelings, so that way they will know that you know they're making a good choice here okay yeah true love somebody feels like you're their true love a pure love an honest connection coming in a new love okay yes open relationship see but some of you guys just want to be friends okay some of you guys there's a true love coming in but in the in the beginning stages you're just going to have an open relationship but this person wanted an open relationship they didn't want any commitment it was just casual okay yes but I do see your money coming in. Lots of lots of fucking money. Okay. This person may be a darker skin kind of person. Okay. I do see you traveling as well. This person may live overseas. All right. But you freed yourself from this person. But somebody's freeing themselves from a connection. You freed yourself from this non-committal kind of person. Okay. This person was possibly money hungry. And I do see somebody new coming in. This person is possibly younger than you as well. Does it have to be? But home. I, get, I do see you purchasing a home. But this person possibly had a family or was in a situation as well. But I do see somebody, a divorcee coming in. But you're in your ice king, ice queen kind of uh, mindset where you're cutting out the bullshit and you're speaking your truth. Okay? But you're using discernment with everyone because right now you're focused on career and business. And there's definitely a, a emperor, empress coming in. Okay? What else? One more? Yeah, this person may have children or there may be children involved or pregnancy. Okay? Yes. But for whatever it is, I do see a combined family. Some of you guys may be into real estate, purchasing homes, flip homes for a living. Yeah, but I do see you guys just dating. For some of you guys, it's just beauty. Just, I'm 
just just dating okay okay just choose wisely all right guys let me pick some um some of these here okay let me see this Yeah, engagement ring. I cannot make this up. Somebody's pretty. Somebody's getting engaged here. Okay, there's a partnership coming. Okay, heart with a key. Somebody again, you hold the key to somebody's heart. Happiness, a soulmate coming in. Okay, welcoming new love, meeting some, meeting the, meeting somebody new. But you again, not today. You're saying not today. Some of you guys are like, not today, not tomorrow, not ever. Okay, yeah, this was a mirroring energy. Okay, a lot of self-reflection and introspection going on here. Okay, but girl with a snake in reverse. You're catching people. You're catching these snakes out in there with their with their bullshit. Okay? Yeah, but you're not paying people any mind. You're blocking this energy off. Yeah, because you were stabbing in your back. Okay? And now you're healing. It was a lot of deception. Okay? And you're making healthier choices. Eating healthier, healthier relationships. Okay? And being much happier with oneself. Yeah, you're and you're unmasking people at this time because there was a lot of people that were talking shit. And you're like, you know what? Fuck you. Okay, I see you. Don't ever think I don't see you, motherfucker. I see you. I see you. <clears throat> I see you. Okay? Joke's on you, though. Not on me. Yeah, the unseen. So there's a blessing that you don't see. Magic happening behind the scenes. Okay? Not seeing the full picture, but you see hidden. A lot of hidden enemies, a lot of jealousy and envy. Protect your energy. Cleanse your space. Okay? But hide in two intentions. Being two-faced. There's a lot of two-faced around you. Yeah, toxic people that you're getting rid the fuck of. Okay? Toxic situation, toxic bad habits, smoking, drinking. You're getting rid of that shit. Okay, third party in reverse because somebody's you came out of a third party. Okay, somebody's coming out of a third party and coming back single. Okay, but right now your heart is frozen. Okay, some of you guys feel like your love life is blocked. Okay, but you're frozen in some areas in life and you're just focused on business and your ideas and writing down your ideas. That's it. <laughs> when it comes to love, you're like, fuck love. Okay, you're giving yourself time off to relax, to rest, to rejuvenate. Some of you guys are retiring out there, going on vacation, pampering yourself. But there was too many secrets and lies surrounding this. Okay, there was a lack of communication, hidden factors, but you're moving in silence. Okay, yes, you're between worlds at this time, practicality and spirituality. Okay, yes, boredom. Somebody's bored, but some of you guys may be housekeepers out there, work for a hotel, own hotels, or whatever the case may be. But cleaning up the act, decluttering. One more. And fragmented. Yes. Your mind is everywhere at this time. Your ideas are everywhere. Okay. The picture is incomplete. Eight. Okay. Still under construction. Okay. But you have too many things going on at one time and you're going to have too many options. So you're trying to get aligned at this time. Okay. You're trying to get aligned. Come in alignment. All right. But there's too much shit going on around you at this time. And fake motherfuckers. Okay. Yes. Let me get some jobs here. Yeah, some of you guys may be janitors, but you're cleaning up the act. Okay. Some of you guys may have exotic animals or snakes or love snakes. Okay. You may be born in the year of the snake, but there's a lot of snakes around you. Okay. Yeah, computer network architect. So IT, but I see networking on the computer. Okay, social media. Yeah, dental assistant. Some of you guys need to go to a the dentist or dental appointment, but dental assistant or dentist. Okay, construction workers, rebuild building something, architects, work with your hands, building something from, something from scratch, wind turbine technician, so the airplane, something with the airplane. Some of you guys are accountants out there, paying attention to your money or have a personal accountant. Okay, sales representatives, selling your ideas. Okay, have a meetings, hold the meetings on products. 
okay? Graphic design, coming up with your own, um, you know, logo or some sort, okay? Medical laboratory technicians uh, going for blood work or health concerns, like I said. So go check your, go check yourself, okay? Blank, all right? So that means you don't really know at this time. You're in between, okay, what you want to do. Again, some of you guys are entrepreneurs. You don't work for any of this. You just entrepreneurs, <laughs> okay? Coming up with your own shit, okay? Sales representative, again. Okay, warehouse manager, Amazon, yes. Work in some type of warehouse, security. Yes, some of you guys are nurse, again, with the health healthcare field, okay? Athletic trainers out there. Okay, really into your body or this person. Okay, industrial designer. Yes. Chiropractor, or you guys need to go to the chiropractor. Kitchen manager or chefs out there. Own your own restaurants. Animator, draw for a living. Cartoons. Fashion designer, coming up with your own clothing line. Yeah, a lawyer. Again, some of you guys are going to court. Financial analyst. Yes, paying attention to your finances. Discussing your finances and where you should uh, invest. Web designers. Again, coming up with your own social media base. Librarians. Some of you guys um, love to read books or learning something or teachers or professors out there. Okay, but schooling oneself. Okay, or some of you guys are building a library in your own house. Okay, yes. Have a lot of books. Okay. Very knowledgeable, very wise. Yes, the past. Okay, so some of you guys are still reflecting on the past. Some of you guys may love old school music as well. Music is very healing to you. Some of you guys may be musicians out there. Again, directors, producers, songwriters, singers of some sort. All right, but your past good deeds, you're getting rewarded from, for. Okay, guys? Receiving money for your past good deeds. Say yes to the things that you think you can't do. Yeah, some of you guys are counselors out there, psychics, tower readers, or negotiators, uh, union reps, okay? Yes, where you defend people, uh -huh, speak up for people. Yes, loss. But what was loss is being restored. Some of you guys may have damage to your home or, you know, a car, but you feel like just things are just crumbling around you, okay? You, some of you guys may have lost a job as well, but I do see a new job coming in. Yeah, you were dealing with somebody that was lying. Be careful with somebody that's stealing from you as well, okay? But unreliable people you're getting rid of, okay? Yeah, justice. You're going to get justice because there was somebody lying on you here, okay? Yes, and they're going to have to pay a lot of money. Some of you guys may be in the military, police officers. You're, no, you're exploring at this time, okay? Exploring new ideas, going into the unknown. Astrologers out there. Not afraid of the unknown and reconsider a decision. Okay, but you're all about taking risks and I do see celebrations. Okay, coming your way. Victory. Yes. Yes, and decision in, fi decision in fear, control. Yes, control. Some decisions and choices that you have made are based in fear and not heart-centered knowledge. Fear is your ego wanting control. Take a step back and make a responsive choice rather than a reactive one. Reconsider a decision. <coughs> then you're able to see the truth of the best choice with a calm and centered manner. Okay, so think about things before you react. Reconsider a decision and set. <laughs> communication networking somebody wants to communicate okay a reunion could bring love or a rekindling of friendships 
A lucky win seems likely. A lucky win seems likely. Luck is on your side. Okay, lucky Libras. I'm going to put that. Lucky Libras. Yeah, you guys are lucky Libras. <laughs> uh -huh. Yes. Um, one more and I'm ending your reading. You lucky Libras. Okay, lots and lots of fucking money, man. And I see you marrying into wealth. Okay, yes. Whoa, lots of money. Yeah, yeah. Opening up your own business. Whoa, taking off the moon. But with the star and the moon here, this is a soul contract, a soul connection that you're going to be coming and aligned with. Okay, you're on a spiritual uh, mission. Fleet and fun, so you feel like your funds are leaving. Unknown source. Mm -hmm. The unknown. Being guided. Yes, you're being divinely guided. Okay, to the sea. Career, moonlighting, odd jobs, night shift, and part-time. Okay, but you're being guided. Whatever it is, you're being guided. Okay, so be careful with how you spend money at this time. But I do see lots of money coming in. Somebody losing money. Okay, yes. Okay. But anyway, I have to go, Lucky Libras. I'm possible. You're possible. You're a Tosh. I'm out.